Today I'm going to show you how to wrap dry bob length hair. Um, I'm going to use um, the styling brush which is really good for wrapping around the head of the hair and just to really smooth the hair out. Um, then to finish off, because my hair is um, naturally curly and I want to like really get a bit of shine and sort of smooth on the ends of the hair, I'm going to use this large radial brush. And the product that I'm going to use is the Colour Enhance Oil. Uh, which is this oil here. What that does is just really moisturises the hair and it's also going to protect my hair as well. So to start I'm going to put a couple of pumps of the oil in my hand and then I'm going to rub that through my hands. Now when putting the oil in don't go straight into the hairline as it's an oil and you don't want it really near the root area. So I'm going to sort of start in the mid lengths and ends of the hair, working all the way around and then just really concentrating on the ends of the hair. So that's usually where you need the, the moisture and the nourishment to smooth out the hair. I'm going to use um, a nozzle to blow dry my hair. Um, so you just attach it on the end of the hair dryer. This really helps when you're smoothing hair out to direct the airflow. So hold the hair dryer up high and point down. If you see if I go like this, it just blows the cuticle layer up and just makes it really fuzzy. So by holding the hair dry and pointing the airflow down, that really helps to smooth the hair out. You can see it smooths the hair out without making it really, really flat. By wrapping it all around the head and using the airflow to smooth down the cuticle, it gives the best result for fringes, bobs, medium length hair for smoothing. So as you can see my hair is about 90% dry now and I've got it fairly smooth but there's still just a little bit of puffiness here that I want to smooth out. So I'm going to just section my hair just in a couple of large sections. Now depending on how good you are with blow dryer, you can use the hair dryer and the brush like this and kind of use the nozzle to help to smooth it out and then apply some heat. If you're not so good with the hair dryer and the brush at the same time, you can always have the hair dryer sitting down using your hand and the brown brush. Pull the hair out, smooth the ends under, roll in and then apply some heat. And that will also help to smooth it out as well. Because I want a little bit of a little bit of height just at the root area, I'm lifting the radial brush up in a vertical direction and then rolling the ends under as I'm applying the heat with the hair dryer and the nozzle. And then bringing it down and then smoothing it right down the ends there. the look I want a little bit of extra shine so I'm going to use the high shine glosser which is an aerosol shine spray which I much prefer because it's it's a drier mist rather than a wet mist from a pump so just shake the can and then just a light mist as you can see it's really really fine 